There was a place where humanity met the supernatural. A place where things we didn't really think were real actually exist. Well, you're in luck, because this is the top three most haunted places in America, part two. Let's go. Number one is Moundsville Penitentiary. During its more than 100 years in operation, the Moundsville Penitentiary in West Virginia is one of America's most violent correctional facilities, and that's saying a lot. And on the final stop for almost 1,000 criminals. The prisoners lived in cramped quarters which led to riots. Many men were hanged or killed in the electric chair, while others were murdered by other prisoners. The prison was officially closed in 1995, but according to some, the tortured spirits are still behind bars. There are still tour guides that lead you into this prison, and many people report hearing screaming and banging on the bars. An absolutely crazy place. Would you visit? In at number two is the Vasilla Axe Murder House. Beware, this one is extremely gruesome. On June 10th, 1912, the old white frame house at 508 East 2nd Street became a grisly crime scene. The heinous murder of Joshua B. Moore, his wife, their four children, and two young girls rocked the small town of Viscilla, and the murderer was never, ever identified. Scarily enough, over the years, residents of the home have reported visions of a man with an axe, children crying, and unexplained paranormal activity. In 1944, the home was restored to its original condition with no indoor plumbing or electricity. These touches add a chilling ambience to the once haunted house. And there are even group tours now that are offered there. However, beware. People hear children screaming and can even say the and even say that they can hear two of the little girls crying every single night in that house. Yikes. Finally, coming in at number three, and maybe the most disturbing one is the Sultan's Palace. The Sultan's Palace, the house at 716 Daphne Street, is a classical French beauty with classic wrought iron balconies and a massive courtyard. But in the 1800s, this residence was a house of the horrors of the Sultan, a wealthy man with an extremely, extremely depraved lifestyle, multiple wives and children, and a harem of young women and young boys held against their will. Neighbors complained about the mysterious habits of this man, who had a very big fetish for partying, opium, and especially torture. But the greatest mystery in the house was the Sultan's demise. When he was buried alive in the courtyard, his family was hacked to death right after, into little pieces by an unknown perpetrator. People report that today his angry spirit is throughout the house, responsible for unusual noises, loud music, and strong smells of evil incest that waft through the home. Female residents even swear that they have been groped, touched, and molested by the ghost of the Sultan himself, believing that he's still up to his old tricks. Question to you guys is, would you visit any of these places or even take a tour to any of them? Let me, down, let me know down below why or why not. Also, if you guys enjoyed this video, please think about subscribing, commenting, and clicking that notifications button. Thank you guys.